SOLIDWORKS 3D CAD software contains many powerful tools that allow you to reuse existing parts and assemblies, which can also be shared on your network. In this demonstration, we will look at Toolbox, the Design Library, Smart Fasteners Technology, and 3D Content Central. Toolbox contains thousands of industry standard fasteners and parts that can be used individually by dragging and dropping them in assemblies. In this example, we will show how SOLIDWORKS Smart Fastener Technology makes use of Toolbox components to automatically select the correct fastener type and size for holes requiring fasteners. Here, we will add two bolts to fasten the support bracket to the table. To activate this command, click Smart Fastener in the Assembly Toolbar. In the selection window, pick one of the holes requiring fasteners and select Add. SOLIDWORKS will locate, in Toolbox, the correct fastener for the hole type and will automatically select the correct size and length of the fastener. Once the fasteners are added, you may wish to add additional hardware, such as washers, lock washers, or nuts. In this example, we want to add a washer under the head of the fastener. In the Top Stack section of the Smart Fastener Property Manager, select the desired washer. SOLIDWORKS will add the washer to the assembly, adjusting mates as required. The design library is a great place to store commonly used parts, so everyone on the network can then access these parts. When the design library is activated, thumbnail pictures of the parts are shown. This allows you to visually see the part you will be using in the assembly. To bring the motor into the assembly, simply click and drag the thumbnail picture into the assembly. When the part is close enough to the gearbox, release the mouse button. SOLIDWORKS uses SmartMates to assemble the motor into position on the gearbox. With the motor now in place, we want to add fasteners to hold the motor in position. We could look up the proper fastener in the motor catalog. However, it is more efficient to make use of SOLIDWORKS Smart Component technology. Smart Components allow us to store information in parts and assemblies, such as what bolts go with which motor. To add these bolts, simply right-click and select the Insert Smart Feature option. We realize that we need a piece of air filtering equipment for our design, and we know we don't have it in our design library. A quick check with purchasing tells us that we need to get this from SMC. Another excellent source of design parts is the largest repository of SOLIDWORKS supplier certified models, 3D Content Central, where you have access to thousands of suppliers' parts. You can access 3D Content Central via the Design Manager interface and you will have a choice of looking for parts by category or supplier. We also have a choice of other SOLIDWORKS user parts. However, we want certified models directly from the suppliers. Click on the icon to activate 3D Content Central, and you are taken to the website where you see that hundreds of suppliers are providing thousands of parts and assemblies. We are after SMC, so let's click on that link. We are taken to the main catalog page, and from here, we know that we need airline equipment. Next, we want both filtration and lubrication. So, we select combination units. Since we are after the unit itself, we select the specification link. We know from a previous project that we want something in the AC40 series. So, we select the first link, and we are now at the configuration page to select the exact variant we need for our design. We have the configuration options, a 3D preview area to see exactly what we are getting, and several download options. Our size is going to be 40, and we need a port size of 3 8 Finally, we want our unit to have a metal bowl with a level gauge. Once a valid design is selected, we can update the preview. Then we can rotate and zoom the part for review. In the Download options, uncheck the Zipped option and select the Download button. You want this part available in the Design Library. 
so select the folder location required. Now you can close the 3D Content Central window and return to the assembly design. Going back to the design library, you can see that the part is now in the library, ready for use. You can now drag and drop the part into the assembly. As you have seen, with SolidWorks Toolbox Components, Smart Fastener Technology, the Design Library, and 3D Content Central, SolidWorks 3D CAD software enables you to focus on what you do best, design better products.